Today we are going to create SVGs on our computer to work with Cricut Design Space and the Scan and Cut Canvas. I'm glad you can join me, so here we go. Alright, let's get started by selecting the pumpkin. We can view the image, right click on it, you can either save it or copy it. I'm going to just copy the image. And then we can go over to make the cut and press the plus if you don't have a project already started and then we'll come over to this these dots that's an import image for tracing and we can paste the first color is already selected so we can import that very easily select your import and then we'll continue tracing then select the color and it's going to be orange for the pumpkin and we're going to black that out so it doesn't cut out the eyes and the mouth and now we'll import that and we will finish tracing you can click off anything that's blank you can just X out and so it's not in your way now we're going to select the stem and the eyes and put them on their own layer and we'll close the clipboard trace one and we'll turn it off so we don't see it and we can now make our zoom level smaller and I'm going to come down here and select break once we break that we have the stem piece separate the eyes are separate so I'm going to select the stem and I'm going to put that on its own layer since it will be its own different color. And I'm going to make a reddish brown. I can take the eyes now and just make in the mouth and make them black. And this is what it looks like. But on the black, let me turn off the eye and the black. You can come down here and see that there's a added thing. You can hit break again and then highlight it and hit the scissors or the delete key. Then you can go back to your black and join everybody together again. So they are all one piece and they won't move. And there you go. So now we can come up here and we can select, um, select all down by the arrow and then I'm going to make it about four inches. and maybe a little bit bigger so you can just drag the arrows and notice it's four point whatever and then we're going to export SVG and I will put it on my desktop and we will call it pumpkin and save it and it's an SVG and then we can go back to the internet and visit Cricut Design Space and over here we will upload and upload the image browse on my desktop yes I make mugs and we will select the pumpkin on my desktop and we will open it Oop, not highlight it there we go give it a minute to upload and there it is and it's already titled pumpkin so we can save it we can come over here since it's uploaded click on it insert image and you'll notice on the right it's made it all um, different layers and it's also made it larger so I'm going to go back in to make the cut, check my height and width, and my width was four point something, so I'm going to just copy that, go back into Design Space, back over to the width, change that, and there you go. Now it should be pretty close to the same size as what I had before. We can just move it over onto the canvas if you wanted to add other things and they're all on its own layer now as you can see the different colors and we can make it and here we go sorting sorting it by the colors and finished and you can continue it to cut it out so the next thing I will show you is how to do it on the scan and cut canvas okay now that we're in canvas is very easy just choose your file 
redo it because I'm on a different computer. But uh, my, there it is, the pumpkin SVG, and you can upload it. And here, because it's all in separate layers, you can drag your pieces. I forgot to make that one black, but that's all right. And there you go. And then you can just download them, choose to save it to your desktop, or you can save it um, to the cloud if you have, and you just close and cut. I hope you enjoyed that, and please feel free to contact me or ask me any questions, and uh, thank you for joining me today.